So far, we have talked a lot about the constants that is the integer, float, string, character, different type of constants, value and how you can write them. Now, in this video, we'll see how to define an identifier as a constant using the const keyword. So basically, the implementation will be quite simple. Here, we will use a const keyword before defining any identifier as we used to do like earlier. We said like int var means then var is a variable. Now here, just before the data type, I will use this const, const keyword. So let's see practically how to work with the const. So now using this const keyword, as you can see, initially, if I remove this const, it will be treated like a variable means all these identifiers like a, f, d, c will be treated as the const as a variable. But as soon as I have added the const keyword, you are necessarily required to initialize these values as after this, you will not be able to make any changes into these values because we have already discussed about the L value and R value. And on the basis of that, on the left hand side, there must be a variable. But here, this C is not a variable, but a constant. So if I will try to compile this particular program, it will give me the error in this particular line saying that is the assignment to a read only variable C means it is now a constant and once it is initialized, you will not be able to change it during the execution of this program. So this is how using the const keyword, you can just define a constant very constant type and then you can initialize it with the particular value which you want to use throughout the program. 